Uh, if you are new to Forda, if you don't know what an agent is, and this sounds kind of kind of foreign to you, uh, an agent is really just, a, it's a program. It's a script, either in uh, JavaScript, TypeScript, or in Python. And these are agents that are constantly running and they're looking for anything suspicious uh, that, that occurs on the Ethereum blockchain or uh, soon to be uh, EVM compatible uh, blockchains, uh, layer one, layer two, uh, et cetera. Uh, so we're looking for transactions that look out of the ordinary. They, they, they look anomalous. Something's weird about them. That's what the agent is looking for. Uh, or if there's some huge change in the value of a contract, uh, value stored, or, or some huge transaction uh, on a smart contract, that is what agents are, are here to do. Um, they are the runtime security for decentralized finance. So Forda doesn't sleep, okay? You, you, you need to sleep, I need to sleep, but Forda doesn't. So these agents are always running and every time another block is mined, you know, every 13, 14 seconds, these agents are running against them to look for these anomalous things. Um, if you go to Forda Explorer, I'll, I'll show the link later on. Uh, there are currently 237 active agents that are scanning different things uh, in, these, in these blocks that are mined in these transactions. Um, you know, perhaps soon your agent can be out there and hopefully this will help you get to a place where you can publish some. Uh, I do wanna give a quick shout out for the Forda Agent Developer Contest. It's a great way to get involved and there's a, a really good opportunity there to possibly uh, win some NFTs or win some crypto on the other side. If you, if you come out with a really slick agent that works well, uh, I encourage you to join the Forda Discord if you haven't already. Uh, it's a great place to see the announcements for these things and uh, yeah, so hopefully, soon you'll see your name as one of the winners of, of those contests. Um, I've got the entire process that we go through. This is probably 50,000 foot view of, of the steps we go through when we develop agents here. Uh, we start with the requirements. What is this agent supposed to do? What are we looking for? What is the protocol? How does it work? Uh, create. So we, we're actually doing the software development in this phase. This is where the bulk of this talk is going to occur. Uh, we need to test them. We need to make sure they work. Uh, af after we have kind of convinced ourselves individually that they work, we pass those on to other seasoned developers, other people who are um, who who know their stuff, and and we submit it for critical review. Uh, that this is a, a this is a critical step. Um, then we 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 go on to where the rubber meets the road, and we actually push publish. We we put this agent out there to scan live as blocks are mined. So that's that's really the exciting part. Uh, and then we don't want to forget that as these agents are running, you know, updates may need to need to occur. We may find a bug. We may have a new feature we want to add to an agent that's already out there. So we need to maintain them. So I'm, I'm going to go through each of these in, in a bit more detail. Um, you know, please collect your questions if you have any, and we'll, we'll try to get to them as best we can at the end. 